Keith One Time Thurman is back. I repeat, Keith One Time Thurman is back. He looked great tonight. He looked great. Didn't get the stoppage. I felt like that had a lot to do with the 10 ounce gloves. But he looked. Oh man, he I didn't expect him to look this good. I thought it would be more rust. Look real crisp combinations. Came off smooth. Still had his legs up under him. He got hurt to the body. Uh, he survived. But, you know, that's Keith. Keith's going to get hurt to the body in damn near every fight. But he looked real good. Uh, the power looked good. He, he hurt Barrios a bunch of times. He, di he didn't get him out of there, though. But the speed was there. Uh, foot quickness was there. Power was there. Reflexes. Uh, reflexes a, a, a dash slow. Not enough to where it was, though. It was really, really noticeable. But he might need uh, another fight before he hits the elite level but the welterweight division needed this right because all you talked about was Crawford versus Spence Crawford versus Spence and then you know some fans are excited about Crawford versus Ugas but those are only Spence fans but now you add Jerron Ennis you add Keith Thurman you add Virgil Ortiz there's a lot of matchups a, a lot of fights that you know you just want to see and at 135 135 is the division that none of these fights has happened, but we've never seen Thurman versus Crawford. We've never seen Thurman versus Spence. We've never seen Thurman versus Ucasa. We've never seen Thurman versus Boots. So even though we got the Garcia versus Porter and the Garcia versus Thurman, we have a whole laundry list of fights that we've never seen that I'm willing to pay money for. I don't know about you, but shit, take my bread. Boots versus Thurman next. I like that. Crawford versus Thurman next. I like that. Those are good fights. And just the excitement. Like the, the guys at the top are really, I ain't going to say soft spoken dudes, but they walk with a big stick. Boots, uh, Spence, but they don't really talk too much. They walk with a big stick. But Thurman, he brings the excitement in the ring and outside the ring. He talks a lot. And having that at a press conference is must see tv so i can't wait to see keith back in the ring i can't wait to see who boots fights next i can't wait to see ugas versus uh spence can't wait to see who bud's next opponent's gonna be but shouts out to thurman man he looked like the old keith thurman at night i haven't seen keith look like that in years he didn't look like that against manny he didn't look like that against jose de lopez he looked great and Mario Barrios, man, he's a warrior, man. He took it, took it, gave some back. And uh, I think Mario Barrios might be better at 147 pounds, even though I don't think he can beat any of the lead guys. He just might be better because he 140 might have just been a bad cut. But yeah, Keith, phenomenal performance. Shouts out to him. Can't wait to see what's next, man. Um, let me know who you want to see Keith fight. And don't forget.